Guys, what's up? It's Jonathan with One Big Impact. So first of all, you see my bag right there? Right there. Um, it just got home about two minutes ago. Well, no, it's been about a half an hour now. I'm a bad judge of time, I'll tell you that. I don't even know what day of the week it is. I'll be completely honest. I know it's 12.18 at night. And for some reason, I'm like wide awake and I'm drinking coffee because apparently where I came from, it's like 8 o'clock in the morning. But I did just start getting a little bit tired, so I'm like, oh crap, what do I do? Do I go to bed? Do I go to bed? No, John, you can't go to bed because you got freaking mail. <laughs> this one's from Jennifer and Brandon, and it says, share the love challenge. Now, bear with me. Ooh, found my little knife. This thing's dangerous as hell. If you have one of these at home, be careful. These are not for children, okay? These will hurt you, okay? If you think they're not sharp, then you will cut your finger off. Don't play. So, this may be a little bit... Oh, and it says one big impact in pen. And it's funny because... Um, Sometimes I, I just tell people, hey, if you want to send me something to my home address, by the way, 7448 East Baseline Road, Mesa, Arizona, 85209, if you want to um, send something, I'll be honest, a lot of the times it's easier, like if you have Amazon, just ship it directly from Amazon. A lot of the times that's, that's the best way to do it because I got something crawling on me. Um, because shipping can be really expensive. This wasn't that bad. It was like uh, 21 bucks, which is still a freaking lot of money, you know, considering you got to buy the product first. Karen's the other day was like 50 freaking dollars, dude, to ship a box like this size, but it was a lot heavier, and I think that's what they went on was the weight. I know big packages are usually cheaper through like UPS and FedEx. If you got small packages or something like that, a book or something like that, send it through the United States Post Office. So let's check it out. This is going to be a little bit confusing because she said there's something in here for me, but I don't know what it was. So I don't know what's what. This is for the challenge winners, by the way. Um, uh, oh, let me say this real quick. Tina actually, Tina Billman sent, some, um, sent something as well. I want to show that first because... I don't have to open that. Hopefully it's what it says it is on the outside. It is a freaking food scale. And it's cool because she was able, able to send it in the freaking package. <laughs> Usually they give me problems because of the barcodes or whatever. She got totally lucky. Super cool. I am super excited about that. Um, that I actually have this exact scale. Um, you can pick this up. Um, I'll put a link in the description in the Amazon. All the products that I'm showing you today, I'll put links in the description below. If you use my links to pick them up, obviously it helps me out a little bit. But this is pretty accurate if you're just getting started. Um, that's going to go to one of the challenge winners. Thank you, Tina. You're awesome. You rock. Seriously. Oh, and Tina is doing good, by the way. Um, okay. So, do you want to see what this is? It's all kinds of stuff in here, apparently. I don't know what's what. Did you like how long that was awkward? So, these are... Oh, shit, that's freaking funny. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, I wish one of these were mine. That is too cool. Check this out. Huge... Bubba cups, right? You're like, yeah, the cups are awesome. They're bright, they're colored, they got a freaking sweet ass silicone straw. But then the real shit happens. You want to see what's real about this? Pull it up, wait a minute, show me what you're working with. Calm down. Calm the hell down, John. See, shit like this makes me not want to go to bed. Look at this. That's personalized. And I'm not shipping these to nobody. I'm keeping them forever. So screw all of you guys. No, I'm just kidding. Look. What does that say? 
one big impact on YouTube. That's freaking cool. You thought that was the coolest part? Nah, it gets way better. Way better. Look at the other side. Drink your fat effing water. I wanted to say the F word real bad. Drink your effing water. She put those on there special. Whoa, where's the camera? Drink your effing water. Exclamation point, exclamation point. Which means drink your in water. That is friggin' awesome. It's like one o'clock in the morning and <laughs> I'm screaming. My kids in there probably like, why'd you have to come home, dad? That is cool. Both of them are labeled like that. Wait a minute. Her boyfriend's one of the challenge winners. If I have to send me one of these to you, I'm keeping it. I ain't sending you one, Brandon. Screw it. Nope. You ain't getting it back. You probably got one anyway. Being all greedy over there. I'm <laughs> just kidding. It says wash me. Wash me. That's cool. Do, 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 do. That's awesome. I'm excited about that. So you'll probably never see those again. Just so you know. <laughs> we ain't done, girlfriend. We ain't done. What is this? What is this? If anybody wants to send some money to my home address, because I ain't, ain't got enough to ship all this shit out yet, <laughs> please feel free. Oh, did you see that freaking video from the desk? The desk thing in the video? I looked it up, and they have those pedal desks available on Amazon. If you want a link to send me a Christmas present early, I got you. I'll send it to you. So I'll get a commission off of what you're buying me. That sounds kind of weird, huh? I don't care. I'll do it anyway. Boom! Pure water filter. Description. Link in the description below. These are awesome. I want one. I'm going to get one because they're awesome. This actually... Removes 90%, 96% of mercury, and 95% of industrial pollutant. Reduces chlorine, tastes and odors, and more. Certified to reduce two times more contaminants than Brita. Pitcher. Seven cup capacity. You fill this up, you're almost at a whole day. Filter. Two months. Reduces 22 contaminants and substances. Why the hell is there 22 contaminants in my freaking drinking water? Damn it. Slim design fits in the fridge. Comfort grip handle. Easy fill lid. Pour spout cover. Secure. Filter fit. BPA free. I always see BPA, but I don't know what the hell it is. I think it's like a Burt Plastic Association. I'm pretty sure that's what it means. That's an official term. By the way, Burn Plastic Association. You can use it for pets, coffee and tea, cooking, baby formula, ice cubes, and on the go. In your bubble cup. That's awesome. What else we got in here? Oh. Rubber main takeaway! What? I love these. I hope these are for me. Probably not. But whoever they're for, Rubbermaid Takeaways is always the one I suggest. I will put a link in the description below. I always suggest these because Tupperware, believe it or not, could be a freaking nightmare getting the right Tupperware. These don't leak. They work great in the microwave. They have a pretty good lifespan. They're not forever. They're cheap. They're only a couple bucks for four. I don't know how much these were. I've never bought the bigger ones. Maybe they're like four or five bucks. I don't know. I have no idea. But they're a super good deal. Tina, you rock. Jennifer and Brandon, you rock. Brandon, I'm not sending you none of this stuff because it's too cool. I'm just kidding. I don't know. I, I guess they're for second and third place, first and second place. I don't know. I haven't divvied this stuff out. I literally just got home like a half hour ago. But I had mail. You know how I like mail. I'm not going to damage that box. I'm going to set it down nicely because I actually probably need that for shipping. I should have probably put all that stuff back in there. 
You guys, the next challenge is coming up. I always look down here, but the camera's up there. I know it's weird um, because I'm like talking into my camera, not the wall, but the wall is where the camera is. It's weird. Anyway, next challenge is coming up. New year for a new you. New you for a new year. New you. New year. I'm confused about how to call it. What we're going to call it. But I'm thinking about something. And to be able, help me cop expenses and stuff like that. If you guys want to set anything for the challenge winners, that's cool. It worked out good the first time. I'm not trying to convince you guys to do that. Um, I don't know how you guys felt about that last time. Maybe you'll feel differently when I get the package to your doorstep. <laughs> but um, also, I don't want this to be forgotten about as well. If you'd like to write a letter to anybody in the challenge, uh, anybody that was in the challenge, if you feel like sharing your address, <gasps> please feel free. I got the hiccups now. To send that to me. And if anybody wants to write to anybody a letter in the Share the Love event, um, to let them know how they did and if they inspired them and stuff like that, please feel free. Because it's not always about the money. It's not always about prizes and stuff like that. It's about helping each other out and sharing the love. You know what I'm saying? That was what it was about. And you guys really took a hold. Like, I feel kind of jealous because I don't get to keep none of that shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you guys get all that stuff. That's really cool. That's really cool that a community came together like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, when you think about it, what a freaking family, you know? Well, I know I'm home. I can hear the police helicopter above me driving around. <laughs> um, I was going to say something else. Oh, I don't know why I was knocking on, knocking on wood. But I don't know how you guys feel about this, but I was thinking about this because the challenge is, can take a lot of my time and be very taxing and stuff like that, creating the meal plans. I was thinking about keeping the meal plans private and sending them out privately if you pay $10 per meal plan. So it's like 10 bucks a week or something like that. If the month, if it was a month, it would be like 40 bucks or whatever, 10 per meal plan, and I would send them privately to you. It would be the same one for everybody, so I'm kind of hoping you guys don't just share them with each other. But um, I figured you know that would help me recoup some expenses from being able to ship stuff out and things like that. Let me know how you guys feel about it. Um, if that sounds like a good idea or not, I don't want to like, and here's the thing, you know, if I charge $10 for a meal plan, I'll send it to you privately uh, via Microsoft Word document. And if you don't want to uh, purchase the meal plan, it's perfectly fine. You can um, use the meal plans that are already provided in the file section. But if you want something new and fresh, maybe help me out along the way, um, feel free. I want to know your guys' thoughts about how, that, how you guys feel about that. Because I don't ever want to do something that's like hurting anybody financially or whatever. I just, I don't, I don't want to do that. But, you know, 10 bucks is really not that bad. You know, if we went for a couple months, um, you know, 40 or 80 bucks or 50 bucks or whatever, you could even do half the meal plans. You could say, you know, John, I want the new plan, new meal plan this week. And then not get it next week or, um, you know, get it for one month, not for the second month. Or you could do all, you know, the whole two months or whatever. Thinking about between a 45 and 60 day challenge. Um, I have not hammered out the details, obviously, because I fell asleep on the plane on the second one, not the first one. Um, and I feel pretty groggy and crappy <laughs> right now because I'm sick, too. But um, I'm trying to think of anything else I need to cover. Keith, thank you for the storage device for my computer that I don't know how to use. <laughs> and I'm sure you're going to email me about how to use it now. Watch. I need to take a shower. You know that? You, it's funny you guys don't see my bed. Oh, oh, you can see the corner of the bed right there. I used to make my bed. Since I moved my room around and you guys can't see my bed, I haven't even put a sheet on it for like two months. kind of defeats the purpose of hiding it when I just told you, you know? I actually use it as partial desk. Do you want to see my bed? Do you want to see my bed? This is stupid. Why am I showing you my bed? Look, look, look. It's a desk extension. <laughs> see? It makes my desk, my desk bigger. I clean my desk real good, and I chuck everything over there, and then it's good to go. It's out of my way. 
And I have a clean space and working environment. It works out really good, you know? It does not work out really good. It's a freaking mess. But, you guys, keep up the good work. Whether you're in the challenge or not in the challenge, it doesn't matter. Um, the reason we're doing this next challenge is because around the holidays, wouldn't it be nice if you're the person that doesn't gain weight and doesn't wait for the New Year's resolution? or the fake year's resolution. 95% of people statistically fall off their New Year's resolution within 30 days. So if you're doing it before then and actually making the choice not to eat bad during your New Year's or during the holidays and stuff like that, you're gonna be the ones that are holding on strong to your goals and achieving whatever weight loss that you're looking to achieve. So keep up the good work. Remember to spread love, not hate. Hashtag be stronger than excuses. Hold on, I wanna show you something. These are going out. These are going out like right away. Um, some people ordered some. If I didn't show you guys these already, these are the dog tags. Healthy living for a healthy life. They come brand new in a package with a silencer. And then the other one, it's like six bucks per or 12 bucks for the set. It comes with two chains. Two chains. I'm a rapper. No, I'm not a rapper. Although I like freestyling. Is that weird? I'll never show you my freestyling. <laughs> never. It's private, but I do it a lot. Um, this one says, be stronger than excuses. Healthy living for a healthy... No, it doesn't say that. <laughs> I'm lying. Be stronger than excuses. One big impact. I will conquer. Because we're seriously... This is a battle every day. Every day is a battle to lose weight, to stay on track, to be healthy, to live a changed life. So if you guys are looking for those, send me a private message. I will email you a invoice, 12 bucks shipped out for two of them um, for the set. Super cheap. I'm not making a whole lot of money off them. I think I'm actually making like, if you guys really want to know, it's pretty sad, 50 cents per sending them out. Um, I just wanted to do something besides the bracelets. Also, if you're looking for a bracelet, I do still, I'm not even gonna show you, I got them over there. I do still have some of the bracelets left while they last. Um, and, oh, one more thing. Look at this. Kimberly sent me these. Before I left, I got them in the mail and I was like, holy crap, look, look, look. I'll show you. It's funny because I got these in the mail. And I like Vistaprint. Like Vistaprint's a pretty cheap place for me to get stuff. Uh, Vistaprint comes in the mail, and I guess I can't show you. It doesn't have the, but it says my name, right? Because I, and I'm like, well, Vistaprint's like business supplies, um, business cards, flyers, and stuff like that. And I've ordered from them for years, doing business ventures and stuff. So I open it, and it's got these things in there, right? These things say, "Be stronger than excuses." Can you see? Can you see? I can't see. Damn it. A little tag right there says be stronger than your excuses and then my address for when I send stuff out and I'm like oh that's really cool it must be a promotional thing that they send out you know to try to get you to buy more or some stuff because Vistaprint does that sometimes but I'm like well if that's the case why would they send me you know 50 50,000 of them because I would never buy them if they sent me loads of them <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, it turns out Kimberly sent him to me. So thank you, Kimberly. That was really cool. I was actually super stoked. I was like, am I losing my freaking mind? Did I order these? Like, I seriously thought I ordered them but didn't know. It was like tripping me out. And then halfway through my vacation, she's like, well, let me know if you got it. And I'm like, well, what did you send? I'm like, did you send this? And she's like, yeah. I'm like, oh. <laughs> so I'm not well, I'm not going to say I'm not crazy, but I was not going crazy on this specific thing. I was, but I'm actually not crazy because of it. What the hell am I talking about? Thank you, Kimberly. Thank you, Tina. Thank you, Jennifer and Brandon. Thank you for everybody that kicked ass in the One Big Impact Share the Love event. I'm going to get these things shipped out as soon as possible. If you don't know, you better ask somebody. <laughs> no. First place was Debbie. Second place was Cindy. Third place was Brandon. You guys killed it. Debbie got 37.8 pounds lost. 
Cindy got 26.6 pounds lost, and Brandon hit 23 pounds lost. He was actually up to 25, but I think he might have been drinking some beers. I don't know. <laughs> you guys, keep up the good work. I love you guys, seriously, from the bottom of my heart. Uh, lots of cool, fun stuff coming, so get it gumming. I said gumming. Lots of cool stuff coming. Come on. <laughs> Bye.